Hello everyone, and welcome to this unboxing video for Loot Anime in the month of April 2017. This month's theme is humanity. Mm, oh, the manatee? Things hinted towards in this box are Attack on Titan, Black Lagoon, and an anime that I don't actually know, School Live. Let's see what's inside. Hmm. Interesting inside of a box. Looks like a town so far. I'm guessing this is going to play in the Attack on Titan, though. So, first off, we've got something. We've got the thing from Black Lagoon. Little tin of sorts with the, I believe, main character on it. I've only seen the first episode of Black Lagoon, and it's been some time. So, definitely reminiscent of an ammo crate. Huh. Is that what I think they are, or what they, they look like? Well, first off, they're in bubble wrap. <laughs> um, yep, they're coasters of what appear to be the various characters of the Black Lagoon. Not of the anime, of the group. I don't know any of their names, but here they are. A lot more detail. A little more, more importantly, without each other in the way. They've got a nice corkwood back, so they'll be very nice on a table. Cool! And the box is pretty nice, too. Box in a box! Who would have thought? Alright, on to the next thing. We've got something from what looks like Attack on Titan. Hmm. Looks like a uh, figure collection thing. Let's see here. Gotta get that little bit of tape out of the way. Or apparently three bits of tape out of the way, I think. Or it's just really stuck. Nope, nope, three bits of tape. And it's not randomized. It's as it is on the box. I have no idea which character that is. I'm actually not a fan of the Attack on Titan series. Um, I've read the manga before the anime came out, and I'm not a fan of the where the pace goes. Uh, later on, I, I feel it slows down. There's literally a point, I don't know if this is in Season 2 or not, where, and I won't say why this happens for spoiler's sake, but there's a multi-chapter horse chase. And my reaction is, really? Oh, okay, it's in the lake. I see now. It's like, where does this peg go? Ooh. And then the foot has another peg. It is a very nice figure, though. Oop. Looks, I would say, about three inches tall. So, regardless of my opinion of the series, this is a nice figure. Um, we've got another Attack on Titan thing. I do recognize the logo of the, uh, of the group. Hmm. It looks like a pouch of some sort and has something the equivalent C with the markings of the, uh, blade, I think? I, I'm, I'm guessing it's going to be a pen or something? Oh. This is a pencil. That's lead. Interesting. And a notebook. Or at least I'm assuming you blank. Actually, a uh, grid paper notebook. Interesting. Hmm. I could use that on a LARP someday. It's been very nice. Alright. And then, next up, we have a manga in this box. Yay, another manga. School Live! 
meet the members of the school living club. Uh, there, are, uh, there's the shovel loving question mark. Mark, uh, Kurmi Ibishuada. Sorry, I'm gonna butcher names. Names the big sister figure. Her Yuri Wakasa, club advisor. Her Megumi Sakura, and last but not least, the ever optimistic Yuki uh, Takine. The school's living club is just for your average school organization, where the girls hang out, have fun, and live at school as the sole survivors of a zombie apocalypse. Genuinely didn't see that last bit coming. I assumed this was going to be a slice of life manga, but that makes more sense to the theme. Let's see here, can we find anything that's just like, hey look, zombies! Huh. Nope, this seems to primarily focus, it, it, it seems like it's meant to be a slice of life version of a zombie apocalypse. In fact, from what I can tell, all the zombies are just black silhouettes. Um, a slice of life manga is, by the way, a manga that thematically is just everyday life kind of stuff. Generally high school. There we go. There's an actual zombie. Flesh looks gone and everything. Interesting. And yes, I know I was going left to right. I, I wasn't actually trying to read it. Next up, we've got the phone charm, which looks very fitting from what I was just going over. It's a girl in a schoolgirl outfit by the looks of it, with a pair of weapons all covered in blood. Reminds me of High School of the Dead. Thankfully, I haven't gotten anything from that. Sorry to fans of that. That is a little bit too gratuitous in what it's trying to do. It's like, yeah, at that point in time, seriously. Stop. And here we are with the poster, which looks to have the same girl on it. Just from the back. Oh, no, no. It's, it looks like... So, it first it has this little scene here of her from behind facing off against what looks like a big giant wolf creature and then her da uh, like jumping towards what actually looks more like a dragon looks like I got everything in the box humanity hmm. I think survival or apocalypse would have been better for this one when, um, but it makes sense with Black Lagoon in there. The other two are definitely, you know, here's a zombie survival story, or might as well be in the case of Attack on Titan. All right, that was everything in the box. Oh, wait, I forgot the box itself. Let's see here. Silly me. Oh yeah, th this is Attack on Titan. Let's see here, box lid, box stuff. And like most of the others where it's meant to be done like this, the wide way. The image, like the arcade gaming one from last month, seems to be vertical. It does have a foot on the bottom, though. Which leads me to believe Attack on Titan. Part of me would think that you're supposed to have the lid out, but then you have the chimney here matching up with the image of the chimney on the side. Huh, interesting. That was cool. Alright, so that's everything in the box. Thank you for watching, everyone. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, feel free to press that like button. If you didn't, go ahead and press the dislike. If you, uh, uh, but please try to leave a constructive comment, and if you can. Also, leave a comment in general if you want to. Feel free to share the video if you think other people will enjoy this. Also, if you want to see more like this, or my, un or my various uh, minis game, or minis painting, or let's plays, feel free to subscribe. Regardless, have a wonderful time, and thank you for watching. Bye bye